Hey, what's going on? I'm A Dub from DX Daily Podcast, and you gotta check this out. So, NBA Youngboy reportedly won't be renewing his contract with Atlantic Records. According to academics, the chart topping rapper turned down $25 million to resign, bringing his time with the long standing label to an end. Academics made the claim during a recent Twitch session. There was a possibility he would have stayed at one point, but they weren't talking the shit he talking. Because labels don't really believe in giving you ownership, they believe in only paying you to own you. Again, Young Boy wanted to partner with Atlantic. He wanted to, hey, listen, we partner, but I own my work. Atlantic said, we'll give you more money. You'll never own your work. Not over here. NBA Youngboy has been vocal about his disdain for Atlantic Records for years. On February 9th, he accused the imprint of attempting to blackball him following the release of the Colors mixtape, which debuted at number two on the Billboard 200. Why blackball me? I'm the good guy. I was going number one two weeks straight with the mixtape, so they took it down off the charts. I don't give a F. You still can't stop me. Don't sign to Atlantic if you are an artist. They're not going to support you, especially if you live a certain way. Don't sign to Atlantic. Trust me. The Baton Rouge native, who signed with Atlantic Records in 2017, joins a laundry list of artists who've also been unhappy with the label, including Meek Mill and PNB Rock. Despite Youngboy's issues with Atlantic, he's found plenty of success while being signed to the imprint. In September 2021, Youngboy dropped the number one Billboard 200 album, Sincerely Contrell, while behind bars. He joined Tupac and Lil Wayne as the third artist to have a chart-topping album while incarcerated. He's currently on house arrest after posting a $1.5 billion bail last October. But do you think NBA Youngboy did the right thing by turning down a $25 million deal with Atlantic? Do you think NBA Youngboy should sign somewhere else or just go independent? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and notification bell to stay up to date on all of our new videos. And subscribe to the DX Daily Podcast on all streaming platforms. And as always, make sure to keep it all the way locked to hiphopdx.com.